right, guys, we're going to do a quick comparison here. I bought my brother a camping chair from Amazon that was $40, and I already had the Helinox One chair, which was $140. So we're going to take a quick look at the dimensions and weights of the two, and then I'll maybe try and throw in an update after we use them this weekend to compare the, the two in a real world. So... Here's my little scale. Let's tear this. So this the Helinox one. Real world weight. Nine hundred and forty-three grams. Nine forty-three. <laughs> That's on there, right? 892. So it's actually lighter than the Helinox one. And I'm sure I haven't even opened this up, so I'm assuming there's probably some packaging in there as well. So let's see. I mean it did come with this little strap, but I mean who's gonna use that? Uh, Welcome to our shop. Thank you for the purchase. Okay. So, there's the two pieces. Just for comparison's sake, I'll throw this one out there. lose this it's stitched on either way so feet actually it's a little thinner the the gauge of the aluminum whether that actually means anything in the long run I doubt it but it's probably thicker wall okay so I'm gonna set these things up and I'll set them up next to each other and then we'll go from there first things first and we'll look at the frames uh, you can see here they are almost identical like there's slight differences in the feet um, the construction of the, the I don't know the clips or grass or whatever that holds that all the pieces together look exactly the same minus a few little slight differences I mean obviously these are knockoffs but they did a really good job um, all right so I'll put the covers on and we'll go from there Okay, so there we have it. They're both set up. They are almost identical, like the exact same chair. You can tell there's a little bit of difference in material um, just by touch and feel here. So the Helinox is a little softer, a little smoother. I mean, that could be just because it's been used a few times but it, it hasn't been through that much the mesh is a little finer on the Helinox but actually this stuff is softer and the nice thing about this one on each side it actually has like a little pocket drink holder the Helinox does not so I can try and sit in it you guys probably won't see this but As far as feel goes, it's comfy, 
doesn't feel like it's going to break or anything. I should be using my shotgun mic here, but yeah, I mean, they're, they're similar. They definitely feel pretty, pretty much. This one's a little tighter in on the bottom. So, I mean, I can tell a little bit already just at the stitching. I don't know how long it'll last. Like this is definitely better stitching than the, the Helinox. But for a hundred dollars less, I don't think it's that big of a deal. Like you can buy three of these chairs for the price of this one and it's actually lighter. So like I said, we'll try it out this weekend here, but it seems like it's a pretty good winner here for the price.